Have you guys ever wanted to do something in life, but ended up not doing it because you think it's too late? Sup guys, JDRFT here, and welcome back to another pretty crazy video. Today, we're going to be talking about how you are actually never too late to do whatever you want. Now, I'm going to spit some wisdom here, you guys, you know. Um, you know, I feel like a lot of older people, and even younger people, really believe that they are too late to do whatever they want. Whether it's like going into a certain school or getting a certain job, or even doing a hobby. I feel like when someone says something like that, they're just not in the physical, emotional, or mental state to do it, or they're just really lazy. But, you know, blocking out all the excuses, you really can do whatever you want at any age. It does not matter. When you go to school, you usually are within the same age range as a lot of people. For example, like when you're in like elementary or in junior high or in your high school, you know, someone's just like one, two, three, or even four years older than you. But when it comes to like post-secondary, when you go to college or university, you have people who are all different ages. And it just gets really interesting because then you realize people who are 10, 20, maybe even 30 years old older than you are going back to school to get an education. Now, if I'm being honest, I don't give a crap about school, okay? Like, if I'm being completely blunt, I hate school. I don't listen. I just do my work and I get out. But you know what? I do respect people who are older than me trying to receive an education for their families, you know? Maybe they're not in the best spot financially, but they still go back at any age, doesn't matter, so they could support their family. It is never too late. They could go back. They could get a better degree or whatever and then make even more money than before. And boom, they support the family. People who own well-known franchises like McDonald's, KFC, Home Depot are older than 50 years old when they started. A great example that I like to use all the time is from this guy named Steve Bloom. He became a voice actor around age 31, 32, which is great because most people who start voice acting usually get into it at the beginning of their childhood or towards the beginning of their adulthood. But he is in his 30s and he started in 1992. Now he's like 60 years old, but he voices a lot of great characters. He plays Zabuza and Orochimaru in Naruto, is known to be Tank Dempsey in COD Zombies, and he's really well known as Spike from Cowboy Bebop. I can list so many examples right now, but you know, ultimately at the end of the day, everything comes down to just, you could do anything at any age, no matter what. You may think time is an enemy and a obstacle, but realistically it could be your own friend. You know, you could work with it. It doesn't have to be too late for anything. If you just start now, do whatever you want to do, now then you know eventually that could sprout to being something better in the future all great things take time man and if you do not start now then when will it happen it'll never happen you know and you know by saying that it's too late that's already an excuse you're trying to tell yourself to not want to do it and you know what realistically speaking let's just say hypothetically that it actually is too late like maybe you want to join a sports team and make it into like a really you know competitive league or maybe you wanted to be an astronaut. Something that takes a lot of time from your childhood in order to, you know, be successful in the future. Sometimes it doesn't work out. And I think even if it doesn't work out, the point is, is that at least you tried at that time. And maybe if you try again at a later point in your life, you know, it's never too late. And if that still doesn't work out, then maybe there are things along the line of that that you could eventually follow up and grow into. For being a professional sports player, maybe you could eventually be a soccer manager or like a sports manager, I don't know. And like for being an astronaut, maybe you could be an engineer at NASA. You know, it's not totally shut down from the original point, but at least you could still do it. It's obtainable. But that ultimately just comes down to if you're willing to do it at the point of where you are in life. As many years and months and weeks pass by, there are many opportunities for what you want to do in life. And you know what, say they are closed, you know, those opportunities are not open anymore. Then even more opportunities will eventually grow because you'll be a part of that community. You'll want to know more, you'll be invested. And you know what, eventually something will come by if you are willing to go through with it and you will obtain it, you know, whether it's like getting good at a hobby or maybe that getting that dream job or, you know, acquiring a really good skill. Eventually you will do it if you take the time to do it. But yeah, I hope you guys did enjoy. If you guys have any future suggestions for future videos, please let me know. But without any further ado, don't forget to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.